John Morant suspended for 25 games after showing the gun on video. I mean, it's crazy, but sometimes that's how we got to be, especially if you get a second chance. Just because you make mistakes don't mean that you, you're you not going to be held accountable for your actions. Crazy thing is, he, he did have a good season, man. I mean, he had some impressive numbers this season. 26 points a game. That's, that's, that's some good numbers. Eight assists a game. Five rebounds a game. And one steal a game. All this in 31 minutes a game. I mean, he's one of the most electrifying young talents the league got. But just because you got on the court talent don't mean that your off the court abilities don't play a role in your future. I mean, he basically got screwed out of making an all NBA team. I mean, I love Luca and I love Damian Lillard, but how does John Morant not make an NBA team? all NBA team over them they didn't even play in the playoff games not the not just the playoff games the play in games they didn't even play in but they made it they made it over him and it had to be sh strictly because of the first incident I mean the NBA is a business they're gonna punish you they're gonna punish you if they have reason I would say I, I John Morant didn't deserve it. I'm not going to say that. But I would say... I hope he figures this out. You don't hear this type of story a lot. But... Some players do have a downfall. You know what I mean? I'm not going to say no names. But sometimes people are in these streets. Or... People can't seem to let drugs go. You know what I mean? The NBA is big on certain drugs. So they'll get you out the league because of it. I'm not sure about the drinking problems. I don't think they do anything for drinking problems unless you are proven to be doing much. I think the NBA is a business and they're about their brand and how in the image. So if you if you happen to do things under like not on social media, you know what I mean they'll try to protect you unless it's something outrageous. They'll try to protect you, but once it goes on social media, then the brand is targeted. Once the brand is targeted, it don't matter who you are. You're going to be watched. The NBA is going to feel the need to talk about it, at least. They might let it slide one time and talk to you behind the scenes, but if it happens twice, they're not letting that go. So, like, in John Morant's case, once the first gun situation came out, you know what I mean? You started hearing about all types of situations that was going on. And that's when and those showed me that the NBA was aware of several situations, but they kind of kept it on the hush, probably told them to relax, figure it out. But all in all, through all of that, Memphis Grizzlies was second in the West. They wasn't that far from first place. They probably were two, three games out of first place. You know what I mean? And, you know what I mean? John Morant is their main guy. So hopefully he can come back strong. 25 games is a long time. I wonder how many games is that according to holiday specials out there, like, like the Christmas games. Now, if he's available to play in the Christmas games, that just shows me that the NBA, even though they wanted to penalize him, they didn't put the business over everything. They still wanted to give them some, well, give the team some marketability, it, assuming they're going to play in the Christmas games. And also remember, if you suspended for 25 games, that also means you're not getting paid for 25 games. So that's a big deal. But hopefully things even out.